Welcome back to the Lucky Dog Casino, folks. This is Colby playing some Sim Casino. And uh, we're on the roof of the uh, property because we've uh, we've gotten a notification here that people are getting kind of hot. So we're going to put in some ventilation. And let's see. Okay. There we go. We have two uh, ducts installed on the roof. I wonder if they're going to... Um, it would be kind of neat if they... Um, added like, uh, you have to also have boilers and stuff for the, uh, uh, for hot water for the, um, hotel. Okay, and I also, um, I moved over the... Uh, cash vault. It was here, but then I decided to move it over here. What I'm eventually going to basically do is like basically crab walk it to where it's eventually going to be, which is going to be back in this area. Um, because I want it to be in an area that is going to be secure, and right now this is not that secure. Um, uh, to my mind, anyway, you, it does not seem safe to have a uh, vault on an exterior wall. Um, I don't know if you might be able to hear the train coming. Um, and I also noticed that uh, I had the vault door installed backwards on uh, on the thing. The uh, the lock was actually on the inside here. Um, so. I now have that uh, switched over, and uh, it's now directly right behind the security office. But we are going to, in this episode, we are going to begin work on a bunch of research. Buffet, the theater. We're actually just going to queue all of these up. Um, to have them get uh, put in place, and then we will start work on. putting the hotel together as a and I 
as preparation for that, I'm going to start putting in start putting in orders to have some bread sheet some bed sheets um, actually we're gonna bump that up to 10 crates of bed sheets. ingredients we're gonna bump up because we are going to start working on putting in a buffet and I think for now the buffet is going to be back over in this area as you can see we have a we have quite the uh, stack of money uh, the uh, truck just came but we've I get I have a hundred thousand dollars on hand in the vault at all times uh, now we're getting the uh, We're getting the um, cash out of the machines relatively quickly um, because I don't really want to have it in the machines because I figure if um, it's in the machines, that's more of an incentive uh, for people to try and break into the machines. I'm also going to throw down oh. uh, never mind let me actually I'll bump up the lighting here let me see um, uh, let me see, maybe the lights actually do have an effect on how, uh, effective the cameras are. Let's see. camera booth. Does it even say... Oh yeah, it does. I was actually wondering that.
whether uh, the uh, camera booths have uh, a maximum capacity. I hadn't looked at it before, but they do. So you need uh, for every camera you need, or for every eight cameras you need a security or a camera booth. That is going to make the uh, security office pretty freaking big eventually. Let's look at... Okay, this is one thing that I think... Could be better um, explained is the um, the overlay. If this is because it's good coverage, because it's lighting. Is it good coverage because the let's see Coffee schedule, pace schedule. Got to make sure that we have the booths manned at all times. Okay, I don't think it's because of the I don't think that's because of the um Because of how tall the, uh, how high up the cameras are. Let me see the environmental display. Okay. Yeah, I'm thinking it's probably, it probably has to do with the lighting. So... We will basically go hog wild and light this place up uh, pretty bright here in a bit. Uh, for now, though, let's start working on getting... some extra uh, space built in here. Okay. 
this is basically, I think, going to be a conference room setup. Let's see. Seven uh, Okay, let's see if we'll do seven. Okay, I think what we're going to do then is uh, we are going to clone this room. One, two, three, four. And then what we're going to do is then we're going to take
11, a 7. So we're going to split this in half. Demolish this. And then this is going to be a computer room here. Demolish that wall. I f I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this. I'm just going to keep this undeveloped for now. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to demolish that wall. I'm going to put a set of double doors in. This is going to be a computer room for business clients. These are going to be executive conference rooms, basically. They're going to be a much larger we're going to have a larger conference room with uh, more um, they're going to have a they'll have a larger table Also, with these, going to put this there. Is there a wood grain texture? that with the larger conference tables.
here we go. We're going to have to demolish this area. Let's see, marble. Yeah, we'll do that. There we go. Now we are going to have a whole heck of a lot of business. Clientele. Hopefully. And then... This hallway... Here, I might make a staff hallway. Because I can basically have that run... Um, no, it won't be able to, um, because huh. I was thinking of turning this into the buffet and having removing these two and turning this into the kitchen. Or actually, you know what? Actually, this will be the buffet in the kitchen over here. We'll have the kitchen in this area, so then you know, we'll just move the research office. And this area is going to become the new bingo hall. So... That, I think, is what we will do in the next episode. We're going to move everything over. We're going to demolish this whole area. And uh, we're going to move. We're going to do some rearranging. So stay
stay tuned in the next episode, folks, where we're going to be doing some more renovations here at the Lucky Dog Casino. If you're liking it, please subscribe if you haven't, uh, like and comment, and uh, you know, tell tell me what you want to see for the um, tell me what you want to see for the uh, um, for the buffet. If I get a good selection uh, suggestion, I'll renovate the floor of the buffet to be to go along with those selections. Um, I'm gonna. I'm going to put it in, because I'm going to record that that episode next, um, like right after I get done with this. And then, uh, but after this goes live, after there's some suggestions, um, I'll, then I'll renovate it if I like the ideas. So, you know, leave me in the comments, and, uh, if I like the ideas, we'll put them in. So thank you very much for watching. Have a good day. Stay safe out there. Take care. Colby, out.